You want to master the back lever with perfect form or start with calisthenics, but don't know how? Then convince yourself how easy it is with the right approach to own this basic Kali skill, mastering the back lever to its finest. Before we crush the rings, it's important to warm up specifically for the upcoming training. The dislocate shown here, used with pronated or and supinated grip, are excellent to warm up your shoulders and your biceps in an elongated position. Goal here is to get your hands closer together while maintaining your arms straight. The warm up should always prepare your joints, tendons and muscles specifically for the task that's ahead of you. In this case, we want to make sure we prepare our shoulders in extension and our biceps and elbows in a straightened position. We usually don't recommend static stretches before strength training, but since we train a skill that requires exactly these prerequisites, it's totally reasonable to use static stretches. Before we really go into the back level training, Skin the Cat is ideal to prepare our scapulars and of course our shoulders and biceps. Use full range of motion while maintaining a protracted scapula. The back lever should be one of the first skills to master in your calisthenics journey. It trains all fundamentals required for all other Kali skills as the planche or the front lever. We structured our back lever program not only with the progressions needed to achieve the full back lever, but also with important fundamentals, alignment training and core strength. Remember, always quality over quantity. Clean form and a well-structured program leads to clean results and no injuries. Everyone is able to achieve this skill at any strength level and yes, even if you have heavy legs, it's possible guys. Believe in yourself and enjoy the journey. Remember, train smart and stay healthy. If you like this video guys, please leave a thumbs up and subscribe to our channel and definitely check out our Mastering Back Lever program on our website. The link is in the description below.